Hi, I'm Luis Castaño with IEC's Tip of the Month. Today I want to cover the, the uh, particularities of a butterfly damper. Butterfly dampers, I'm not saying they're bad, but we need to be careful about how they react. A lot of times, uh, especially on small fans, we can see a butterfly damper for flow adjustment. Also, to balance duct work, we may see a butterfly damper to be able to restrict flow and, and get a good ductwork balancing. But butterfly dampers are very quirky, meaning that if you see this in a position of 30%, people think that you're getting 30% of the flow, and that is not the case. In here, uh, one of the disadvantages about butterfly dampers is that when it's completely open in this position, you think there, there's no restriction to flow when in fact there is. So a lot of times for ductwork, we recommend guillotine dampers. Now, uh, what I wanted to discuss is that when you adjust butterfly dampers, play with it. Fully move it in one position and then to the other position from fully open to fully closed and see how it reacts, but it's usually not linear. Sometimes a small change can cause 50% flow variation. So be careful about your butterfly dampers, play with it to get the adjustment that you need and don't just assume that because you've got a lever that shows 30% that you're getting 30% of the flow. That's it for today. Uh, if you uh, would like to discuss this in more detail with one of our engineers, feel free to call us. Thank you.